back to my youtube channel if this is your first time on my channel thank you so much for stopping by and if not thank you so much for returning back to my channel my name is adobe okonkwo on this channel i make videos about productivity building a career lifestyle and just living my best life now if those are videos that interest you then you should definitely consider joining the family by clicking the big red button down below that says subscribe in today's video i am going to be sharing with you guys final week in my life as a student well this is my second to the last semester of my mba program and this week is the last of classes for fall so i'm super excited to be sharing all of that to you with you this week is going to be a little bit lax more of my ga work and there's a quiz that they're going to release tomorrow so i'll start working on that this week i do have a client coming in tomorrow and it's a makeup training class she hasn't paid her deposit so it's a yes or maybe but yeah those are the plan for this week in the meantime when i wake up usually for this kind of classes i won't have time to have my bath because i like using like the first one hour the first 40 minutes to prepare prepare my agenda but fortunately i did that yesterday so i'm just going to be going through my to-do list and knocking out the ones i can knock out before my class because i do have a meeting immediately after the class that i'm pretty sure i won't have time to um do anything before that meeting so that's why i am doing it this way and i like to open like three tabs on my screen so i usually have my canva open my email open my one notes open and of course slack slack is the school like chatting thingy so when people want to reach people like real fast oh it's like the insta chat for our school so that's what i'm going to be doing today i do have to go to walmart later today to return an ugly sweater that i bought for my husband and i because those are not our sizes the other keyboard that i got i'm gonna have to return that one so this is the new one that i got this is the mx mini keyboard why is it scratching already Oh. so this is the one i got this is the one i'm using i had an issue with it uh so i had to do a factory reset apparently it was the way that i set it up i was supposed to set it up i didn't know the us was in north america as stupid as that sounds i think i used the other type of Amer the, the other american continent so the keyboard wasn't function some keys on the keyboard wasn't functioning as it should specifically my tilde key i used the tilde key to delete stuff on my final code pro and it makes my whole workflow super easy so one night i was just so frustrated because i was doing it over and over and over and over and over again and it was just not working so i'm going to stop talking right now gentle reminder to subscribe and join the family i'm going to take the rest of the time to prep and do the rest of the work that i need to get done before that meeting okay
<laughs> and then later I'm going to go downstairs and show you the, the decor that I have. But in the meantime, I want to actually show you some of the new stuff that I got. But I need to switch my, my lens to my 24mm lens. I was going to use the 50mm to film today, but I'm like, mm, should I? Should I not? Alright, let's get started. So I got this new plant from Ikea and it is so nice. So I went to Lowe's and I got that hanging thing. I just hope it doesn't fall off. My only issue now is that when I'm watering it, I have to move the monitor to this side so it doesn't drip on it. But I don't think it has holes, but I definitely do not want to test it on, on here. So that's what I'm going to be doing. It's going to be stupid of them to make it have holes. You know, you know what I mean? <laughs> so that's the plant. I don't know what it's called, but it's really nice. So the whole vibe is now just going to take a step back. And then I did change the, the stool where I had my monitor. The other one was smaller, taller, but it wasn't given and there wasn't enough space at the top. So can you see how I was able to put the plant there? The other one, I wasn't able to put a plant on it. So that's why I was pissed and I returned it. Um, But yeah, that's what the setup is looking like. My monitor, my oil diffuser, it really does help, help calm me. And then this is my beauty station. I know I've been saying I was going to do like a girl cave tour, but I just haven't. But let me just show you guys. So that's my key, um, beauty, my vanity section. And that's where I do all my makeup, my clients. And then I have this chair. My makeup chair is actually in the wardrobe, but yeah and then that's me probably should do an intro here but this is what we're looking like yeah i need to go grab coffee before work gets started and i know that by the time i'm done making the coffee classes class would have started but um we'll figure it out and i haven't quite decided if i want to film with my cmm lens but we'll see in the meantime let's just go downstairs and make a cup of coffee <laughs> I think I'll show you guys more in detail when I'm filming my vlogmas. But well, that's the oven. I just put some Christmas themed towels. And then here I have this deco that I got from Marshalls. I can't remember where I got this. I had it since last year, but this one is a new addition. I really like how this tree brings color or brings life to Christmas. And of course, there's my This Girl Loves Christmas mug that I've been loving. This one I got from Marshalls and he is just sitting cute on here so that's that and then there's our christmas tree yeah just pretty simple lights up when you want it to my favorite new additions are this ones so that's a new tree and then the vase is also new the santa is also new from ikea every other thing that's from the middle section are from marshall and then that book is from walmart so that's that's that with that <laughs> the class is going on but I'm multitasking so somehow I've been knocking out a couple of my to-do lists you know how I said I created the to-do list yesterday well that to-do list was unique for just yesterday so I moved the ones I wasn't able to accomplish yesterday and I added it to the new to-do list let me show you so I have my first class which is brand enterprise i just have three to do lists those are due tomorrow there are some that are due today some email res response that i need to send out that i can actually send out today so i'm going to try and knock those out first so i, I forgot to add return the walmart thingy the walmart order that i had let's do that <laughs> whole 
time I was talking and I didn't realize that my glasses was crooked like what I mean by crooked was like one was going this way and the other one was coming down and I think that's why I don't really like this thin wired ones because like once you fall down and the thing moves certain way to put it back and realign it becomes a huge hassle but I think I was able to fix it just now so this is what we're looking like the class just finished I have my next meeting in 25 minutes or 15 minutes actually so i'm gonna take that time go downstairs and warm my coffee again because it did get cold while the class was going on and i think i added too much coffee syrup so i need to go fix that and once i'm back i would uh, start getting i'll get to work on my on my to-do list but in the meantime let's just go downstairs and get that done they just released my grades for <laughs> that uh, launch project. Ah, I'm so nervous. I know we did a great job. I was shocked if we if we get anything lower than a one to F. Well, let's say one. Let me not be greedy. Let's say one ten out of one twenty. So we're only losing ten points. So let's see what we how. We, the last one we only lost four points. So yeah, I'm just giving myself grace. But I'm so nervous. <laughs> <laughs> all right let's see so we got 113 out of 120 so that's really good that means we only lost seven points um that's one point more than our previous one but who's counting so let's see the feedback they left us hi team five caribou to the uk i wanted to give you some quick video feedback in addition to uh the extensive comments and grade you received uh, by and large i thought your presentation was very good you you had a lot of information that you covered in a variety of different ways um and uh in addition i want to give you a call out and a kudo for uh checking back with us on a regular basis and keeping those conversations at a thirty thousand foot level and yet for those of you who will work in marketing that's a good habit to get into there were a couple of areas Areas where there were technical difficulties uh, talking about the implications that say the research has or the implications of several frameworks I liked how you began to fill in the blank in both countries to me that boy what better balanced research uh, perceptual math again I think you had implications there so well done so with that I so all my assignment and everything is now in and I think I have an A I have I got 94.4 and it's a semester long class so it's four credits so that is really going to be a huge boost to my gpa so let me just confirm that 94.4 is actually a so 94 point exactly at that a level so i'm so happy ah! okay 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 so happy all right and then the other one that is a uh, four credit i'm sure i'm gonna get an a the other one that is another we had like three credit um three classes that were for credit the third one which is pricing strategy that's the one i'm struggling with the group assignment is flying i think i'm going to get my participation max it's now the final assignment so everything is dependent on that final exam so there's no room for any mistakes i'm going to go all in watch some of the videos and see if there are elements from the even the speakers that i can add to flesh out my points a little bit more so that's what i'm going to be doing but i'm so excited i am so 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 happy that yeah i got an a in that course so i'm going to go downstairs and warm my coffee and then once i'm back i'm going to jump into my next meeting which is with my ga role my ga manager i'm about to jump into my next call and that's with my ga manager the coffee is so hot that it actually burns my tongue so i'm going to leave this i baked some cake yesterday well two days ago so that's what i'm just having morning how are you i am very well i know my glasses are still crooked it's like it's so annoying i've been trying to fix the you look good and i like your background just looks so nice and bright wherever you are i think maybe at home but it looks like it's just a nice atmosphere where you are is and that a home. real plant oh yes it's a real plant you <laughs> i love plants i don't have any where i am in my home office some in there um and then i got rid of the flowers kept the eucalyptus and then yeah. i was like okay I'm gonna need guys so just making sure that my glasses are not still crooked it looks crooked but i think we're going to have to manage it like this i am going to start heading out i need to return 
the ugly sweaters that I bought at Marshall, not at Marshalls, at Walmart and then get new ones if they have new ones at Walmart or go to Marshalls and get the ugly sweaters. Um, I think they're a great addition and I'm thinking I'll wear it to school on Thursday for the hangout thingy for my last group meeting if that's what we're going to do. So this is the keyboard that I'm returning to Best Buy. The return window is expiring I think December 11th and then today is December. Today is December. I still have some time but I think I'm pretty, I've made up my mind that this is the one I'm keeping because it has, what does it have? I don't even know. The keypads are better. The indented thing on it makes it easier for you to type. That one, it was very hard like editing or doing anything with it. I don't know, maybe I should try editing one more full video now that I've cleared a little bit of space on my hard drive. Then once I'm done with that, I will then head out since I'm pretty much free for the rest of the day. So I think that's what I'm going to do. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go add some milk to my coffee and then add more milk to that. I did one full video. Once I'm done with it, decide if I like the feel, even though I know that I really like the feel of this new keyboard. And then I'll start heading out to do all the runs that I just mentioned. All right, so that's the plan for today. Let's go downstairs and make something. to start heading out now let's go so i'm gonna return this and i just need to grab my bag and i'm just making sure i have my wallet in the car key my card so these were the ugly sweaters that i got i love the color but it's too small for my husband and i I forgot my phone. Can you imagine that going out without your phone? And also the Excel file again with the, the most tabs uh, and then the, the Excel file with the with the most tabs. Guys, so my package just arrived and this is the like code organizer that I got for the desktop. So this is what it looks like. And I got the white one. But yeah, let's go and fix this upstairs because I'm actually curious to see how it looks like with everything before we head out. <laughs> looks a lot better i don't know if you guys saw what it was looking like before but it wasn't looking nice but now it looks a lot better just looks like a second leg i'm so glad i actually bought the black one the white one because the black would have been horrible but yeah this is what we are working with this i think i need to change i don't like them but we'll see let's go all right for real this time we're actually leaving i think i have everything set it's it's really long so i'm probably going to cut it down there once i figured out how long i want it to be yeah probably not too long i saw one of masha's the the um the cost difference was just one dollar i can't believe it was because of one dollar that i went to walmart and got the wrong size and got a small size thinking i was gonna force myself to fit into it but that didn't work so funny like whenever i don't plug my phone to the car i see that the time is like one hour ahead and when i plug my phone i then see like an one hour below the actual time and then i get confused so what's the actual time that's what i'm struggling with even though that doesn't i'm almost at walmart like literally it's not far so it's like five minutes away from the house and that's why i really like where we live everything is close to each other except for certain other places like ikea is really far school is far but like there are grocery stores around but no african grocery stores then the closest is in fridley which is like 20 minutes or so so technically not very close i'll see you guys when i get to walmart bye Freezing cold, but I just got to Walmart safely. Welcome to Walmart. Thank you. I'm going to go to Marshalls and hopefully they have one. The keyboard that I was going to return to um, Best Buy 
I literally forgot they had home so let's go to Marshall's and if they don't have it I'll just go home grab the keyboard and then go to oh I remember I was gonna see if I was gonna get, uh, find a table mat for the desk I think it's going to be cheaper getting it at Walmart so let's see if they have some options Just arrived at Marshalls and Marshalls isn't that far from Walmart. It's like one minute drive. So hopefully my trip here is going to be in and out. Just wanna go some ugly sweaters. So I'm not taking any cats with me. <laughs> I'll see you guys. I don't know what this is for. Nothing yet. Okay, it fits in the screen. Green is never my color. Let me know what you guys think. We'll get both of them. I finished at Best Buy, Omo, I am exhausted, but I still have to finish up deliverable for tomorrow. So I have a lot of stuff that I need to do, but I'm just going to prioritize. So for my 8 a.m. meeting tomorrow, I think I'm going to have to knock out those today. Every other thing will have to wait till tomorrow because I am so tired and stressed and just exhausted, honestly. But I stopped at Chick-fil-A to get a uh, spicy deluxe burger, the best sandwich I have ever tasted. So that's what I'm doing and I'm getting two each for my husband and because we both like it and it seems like it's going to snow throughout this week and i don't want to be coming out here it's been long i came around this area so that's how everything is going able to return the keyboard i got the ugly sweaters that i wanted to get i think everything is fine not the stuff was about to fall down quiz that i have due next week well not quiz per se so take me home all right so let's head home guys i'll see At you the stop sign i am exhausted i'm gonna take some time and quickly wrap up my like a snowman in my night airs pine needles and marijuana in your hair and i swear these nights ain't they rough when december come around tis the season of the cuff keep my mind out the gutter make food with extra butter make do with something other than you well enjoyed today's video and if you did give me a thumbs up like this video share with your friends i'm gonna go ahead and take the rest of the time to finish up my feedback that i had on my slides and then go and have my bath and sleep this meeting at 8 a.m tomorrow morning so that's why i really need to get this done but i was able to have chick-fil-a so i'm a little bit fueled and i think i have a little bit of energy but aside that, I feel like my whole body has just been hot in, and that's because I've been doing a lot of cleaning. I've been doing a lot this past few days, so it is definitely taking a negative toll on me. But that's not all. I'm going to go ahead and, and, and finish up what I need to do. And maybe I'll pick up the camera when I go and have my bath, or maybe not, but we'll see. But I hope you guys enjoyed it. Give me a thumbs up, like this video, and share with a friend that you think would enjoy this kind of content. Until my next one, guys, I love you. Stay safe, and I'll see you tomorrow.